Yo, what is going on guys? Bobby here and today what we have for you guys is a new Brawl Ball map So Galaxy Arena has come out now. We have seen it one time already We saw it in the PSG Cup, but I believe this is the first time that it's come out in rotation Maybe the second time so we're gonna show you guys a couple broken comps and a couple broken brothers that you guys want to be using on this map Now I apologize that I haven't made a video for the last two days one weekend every month We have our esports world championship challenge and a bunch of all that stuff So you guys know the 15 win challenge we do that and then the weekend after we have our weekend long tournament. Now Saturday is kind of a free day where we make it to the end and then Sunday is the more intense day. Now we made it to Sunday. This time we came third place, but third place is the same as first and second due to new seating. So there's going to be more in the future ahead with this month. But I just wanted to congratulate IX Circles, um, King Garmo, Luki, Tooney, and Slash. Um, they absolutely wrecked us. They swept us 3-0. Uh, we weren't playing normally. We had some Wi-Fi issues, but they're definitely a good team, so huge shout-out to them. They've been working really hard, and if any of you guys see this, congratulations. But anyways, I'm going to be showing you guys a new comp and some new comps. I mean, some not one new comp, but a bunch of new comps and just some good brawlers on this map. So with that being said, let's hop into the game, and let's show you guys how to win every single game on this map. Okay, so here we go into the first game here. We're facing Double Tank Bow. Um, so basically, what you want to do on your team is have tanks or tank destroyers. And then you also want to have either a Poco or just have two tanks and a tank destroyer. So personally, I like going with Poco tank comps. So I'm going to show you guys all the comps here. So I'm going to be the Poco. Now Poco is definitely a top five brawler with his gadget. His gadget just gives him so much heal. It's just absolutely ridiculous. Uh, Tomo's going to pass that ball up to us right here. We're going to just kill this bow. Oh, he's going to play it out. We're going to get that heal to Toma. We're going to use this heal as well. We just have a ridiculous amount of heal. It's it's just kind of unfair. We stay alive for way too long. Um, so the two tanks over here, you guys can see there's a bunch of grass. So the tanks obviously are good um, with a lot of grass. That's kind of just a said. You know, you guys know this already. Going to pass the ball over here to Ali. She should be able to get that goal. She's not going to be able to. She's going to auto aim the ball up ahead to Toma. Toma's going to go for a play here, but I'm going to heal Toma. He's going to go for a trick shot. He's going to fail pretty miserably, but he's going to put that one in the net. Also, the new arena, I absolutely love it. Just arenas as a whole is really cool. So that's definitely a really cool uh, feature type of thing added by Brawl Stars. Ali's going to be able to get a really nice goal over there. So let's hop into the next game, and let's show you guys some brawlers outside of tanks that you could use and could work with on this map. Okay, so here we go into the next game. So what you want to do here... Um, is you know you can have an M's or a Tar. Those are two really good brawlers to play when you're facing teams that will have tanks. Um, so this team doesn't have tank for some reason. I'm not too sure why. But that is fine. We don't mind. We do have a tank counter, but it's also just a really good comp just in a, as a whole. So anyways, really good pass. Again, you guys see there is a lot of grass on this map, so you're able to sneak up really easily. We're going to bounce that uh, BB back and not allow it to regen. Going to take some shots at it over here. Ali's going to get a pretty good super down. We're just going to slowly walk towards the net. Good pull over there by Toma, and we're able to get the goal really early. One to nothing lead. So you guys can see there's still a ton of grass here. We're going to walk up and try and trap them over here. Uh, we're going to do a ton of damage, but unfortunately, we're going to go down. We could have used our gadget there, probably. Anyways, they're going to move the ball up. Gadgets are really useful, by the way. I love gadgets so much. We're going to be doing a top five and bottom five gadget video tomorrow unfortunately today i didn't have enough time because i have another tournament i might post that gameplay one day i'm not too sure if i want to but anyways ali's gonna have the ball over there we're gonna try and use our super and get this bb in a corner over here we're gonna be able to successfully do it it's almost gonna take us out it's not going to we're gonna get the kill ali has her shots she's gonna be able to get that kill and this is going to end the game over here and that is going to be the second game so let's show you guys another comp that you can use outside of these tanks and tank destroyers. Okay, so two other brawlers that you can use are BB and Jackie. Now these are really good brawlers. So basically, let me count, I'm gonna say all the brawlers out. I'm gonna put a list on the screen for you guys over here. And these are all the brawlers that you are going to want to play on this map. So you're gonna have all the tanks. So I'm not even gonna list all of them. They're just all gonna be on the screen. I'm not gonna say them out loud. Then you can also play M's, Tara. Now I wouldn't really recommend playing Shelly as Shelly does get countered by Jackie. Um, but you could play Shelly and then BB. So those are actually a lot of different brawlers that you can be playing. Uh, definitely a really wide option. Your team's definitely going to have at least three of them. It's not like you guys aren't going to have them. And I mean, you guys just absolutely run over comps as you see here. And then obviously you want to add the Poco. So that's going to be all the tanks, BB, Tara, M's, Shelly, and Poco. You could throw in Spike if you want to, but those are going to be it. If I were to make recommendations, I would say put Poco with two uh, tanks. Or if you're going to use the other brawlers and use like a Tara and M's, 
and then a tank or something like that. You don't really want to use a Poco with a Tara or a Poco with an M's because you don't really get the greatest value out of it. Let's show you guys another Poco double tank comp. Let's get into the next game and let's show you guys what's up. Okay, so here we go into this. Now we have a double tank comp over here. So we're going to move forward. Um, oh, we have a Jackie over here. So that's obviously not the greatest. Hopefully, Ali gets that heal. She's going to be able to. Good play over there by Ali. Um, okay, we're going to try and move forward, but not able to do much here. We do have our Primo gadget, which is one of the more fun gadgets in the game. Okay, we're going to go down over there. Really good play by that M's. As you guys see, we recommended M's earlier because it does counter tanks. Really, really good pick to use her. Um, so we're going to move forward over here. Jackie's going to have the ball. We're going to try and get close to the Jackie. We are going to be able to. We're going to get our super, which is like the most important thing as Primo. We're going to be able to jump on people now. Be able to get kills really easily. So let's see what we have over here. Hopefully this Nita doesn't have gadget. Because Nita gadget is definitely one of the most annoying things in the game. It does, but not going to do much over there. So we're going to try and get close to this Jackie. We're going to jump on it over here. We're going to try and make some moves. We're going to jump again. We're going to be able to get heal from our teammate. And we're going to do a good amount of damage, but we're not going to be able to get two kills. Only one, but that's still pretty good damage output. We're able to move the ball up now. Toma being a god Shelly. Um, he isn't doing too much as Shelly, to be honest, but he is probably getting countered, to be fair, by the M's and the Nita. So it does make sense. Actually, does kind of get triple countered here. So it's a little bit unfortunate for Toma. So we're going to stand over here. We haven't used our gadget yet. We're gonna use a jump over here. Good heal over there by Ali. We're gonna go down really quickly. This comp is really good and actually counters us really well. Again, I really wouldn't recommend Shelly, as I said earlier, but it could be played because theoretically it does counter the brawlers that do be used here, or at least most of them, but I still don't think it's a great fit. So I'm gonna jump here, looking to get a couple hits. I'm not gonna be able to. I knew I wasn't gonna get any kills, but I wanted to give Toma some time to clear the ball at least. Toma's gonna clear it. He's gonna put a hole right in front of our net, which is pretty toxic. We definitely do not want that. I'm going to pass the ball to M's over there so it wastes a shot. Toma gets the stun off. I'm trying to get close enough to the M's, but I don't believe I'm going to be able to. Oh, there we go. I'm going to actually get close enough. So I have the ball over here. 20 seconds left. Game is pretty close. There is a Jackie here. I'm going to jump right on the Jackie. Oh, we're going to go down so fast. I mean, Jackie is so good with the combination with Nita right beside her. It's so hard to get a kill. So 11 seconds left, 10. We're about to get into overtime. I'm one punch away from super, but that punch is going to be pretty hard to get. I'm going to use our gadget here and just flip this Jackie over. But unfortunately, I think that threw the game because I put the Jackie right on top of our Poco. So that's going to be the game. So I wouldn't recommend using this comp. Shelly, not that great. I guess this is a pretty good showing of saying the other brawlers I showed are far better. So we're going to do one more game over here. Let's show you guys what to do. Let's hop into it. And we're going to show what I personally think is the best comp on this map. Okay, so here we go on to the final map, and this is what I believe is the best comp for this map. So we're going to have Daryl, we're going to have Jackie, and we're going to have M's. So now we have one really good tank destroyer, but also good against other brawlers, not just tanks. And then two absolutely lethal and mobile tanks. So you guys are going to see Toma's able to roll in, do a lot of damage. Ali's able to move in really quickly. And as you guys can see there, really quick goal for our team. So let's move up here and let's try again. Going to get this Jackie caught in our super over here. Ali's going to try and move in. Oh, we're almost dead, so we're going to have to back up over here. Good plays by our team so far. Ali's able to get that kill. And I believe there's only one left. Going to have to use our super over there. Going to back up and bounce that Shelly or that uh, Tara right into Toma. And that's going to give us the win over there. So we haven't really showed enough of this comp, so let's do one more game. I know I said this would be the final, but we really ran through this team. How did we not get underdog, actually? Oh, I guess it's supposed. I guess it's because of Valley. But anyways, let's do one more game. Let's show you guys this comp one more time because it is really lethal, and I want to show you guys how to play it properly. So let's go into the final game. And let's show you guys what to do. Okay, so here we go into the final game here. So we're gonna be going up against Crow, uh, Frank, and M's. Now Crow, I feel like could actually be a sneaky good pick if you guys can use Crow properly. Um, because he can just expose a lot of people in the grass. So I actually am not too against this crow pick over here. Uh, really good plays over there by Ali. Oh, she's actually going to go down. Going to be able to back off that, uh, that Frank. So we have one person here in our M super. I thought we would have two, but we're not going to. If you have star play or star powers, I would recommend using hype, which is the heal star power. It's definitely been more useful as of late. Um, that crow tried to finesse our team. It's not going to happen, unfortunately. We're going to... I clicked my gadget button like five times over there, but I guess the gadget does not want to be used today. So anyways, that's going to be a death for us. 
But anyways, this comp is really good. We're absolutely running through them. We haven't scored yet, but we're kind of just fooling around here. Probably should have scored a little bit earlier. But anyways, Ali's going to move up. I'm going to try and squeeze in a goal. Thomas somehow going to get stunned by that. I don't really know how, but it's definitely going to be a really easy kill for them. They're going to probably try and put this in the net, but, you know, a little bit of trolling, a little bit of BM. one nothing for our team over here. So the Crow pick actually has proved, proven to be pretty good. So maybe Crow could be a potential brawler to use on this map. I'm going to use my or my stun over there, so we're going to be able to get that kill. <sighs> I tried to use my super again. Did not work. I probably would have been able to stay alive and end up getting the goal, but we weren't able to. So we're going to move up here again. Moving up. Really good roll over there by Toma. He's able to stay alive. I'm going to bounce back that M's to try and keep myself and Toma alive. Toma is running. He's able to live. Really good plays over there by Toma, actually, to stay alive. We used all of our shots over there. Not able to get the kill. Toma going for a sick play. Toma, of course, being the god he is, is going to end up getting the goal. And that's going to be it for us today. So I hope you guys enjoyed learning about all these brawlers and the comps that we've used in today's video. And I hope it does help you in the future with this map. Because it's definitely going to be a map that I think is going to stay and be around often. So anyways, it's going to be it for today. I hope you guys enjoyed. And if you did, make sure to leave a like, subscribe, and comment. I will. See you guys again tomorrow. I'm sorry for the last two video or the last two days there haven't been any videos. And I'm sorry today that I was a little bit clumsy. Just I am pushing right now. I have a, a bunch of content being made for you guys right now. Um, I just can't release it because it does take a couple days. But anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed. That's going to be it. And I will catch you guys again tomorrow. Peace.